Hello, hello, hello. <clears throat> and welcome to this video. Yesterday I was in a restaurant and I was on the at the at the to, at the bathroom. Ah, this this euphemism in the in English, the bathroom, as if there would be some a bathtub in there. Yeah. <laughs> the bathroom. I was at the pissoir and there was a mirror, a small mirror in front of me. And I look at the mirror and I thought like, why is a mirror here? I was really confused. What, what is this for? And then I realized it's to look at yourself to see if you look all right. That was quite an interesting moment for me that I, it took me so long to understand what the mirror is for. Um, yeah, this has not, not much to do with this video, but just a tiny bit because I didn't arrange anything here or with myself also, of course not, but uh, yeah, some things are lying around. Here, actually, I did arrange this. I don't want to lie. There is a little bit of an arrangement. This, this here, this, this is here. Yeah, there. It's to my right. I want to uh, talk about what I think are good next steps in my work and with my community. So if you are a supporter of my work and if you're part of the community or want to be part of the community, then listen. I have a clear vision for what I want to do. It's the exploration of the development of the self but in reciprocity with what is around us, with our community or with the community of people that each of us has with the environment and thus take the journey through life in an active way. And I have formulated this in, in different, uh, different ways of formulating it. But in a sense, no, I, I say this for a long time already and I call it Lebenspraxis and now I added the term of the journey to it. And this needs uh, quite a bit of exploration from my side of researching, of playing in a sense with different things and at the same time my work is also to produce material for you from the community to be there as a mentor or coach or trainer, actually, whatever, however you use these terms, I'm doing all of this. Yeah, sometimes I'm more this, sometimes I'm more this, and sometimes I'm more that. Okay, so I find different arrangements with different people. And I thought, like, how, what would be a good way to support this properly and to allow me and also my team that is working with me, which is currently uh, Christian, Mariana and Franzi, who all have different roles in the team and who all are doing different things. But we are doing it together and there is also, it's impossible to do this alone. Because what would happen if I would work alone, I would have so many things to do, small things, uh, that or such a number of small and big things that it would be, that it would be taking a huge toll on what am I, uh, on my, on the deeper, on my deeper work, actually, on my focus and concentration. And it's, it's, uh, always a bit juggling with the edge of this because I have m different roles that I'm playing. Yeah, Like I said, I'm doing the research, uh, the 
uh, playing, the looking. I'm creating from this material, I'm teaching the material, I'm leading a team and then I have the yeah, tax office writing me letters and I have the uh, insurance for employees writing me letters and I have like blah 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 all these different things and requests coming in. And that would be quite impossible to juggle properly alone. And I'm so happy to work with other people together because I always feel how enriching it is to work with other people together. And I'm on the one hand a person that can also... Um, spend time alone pretty well but on the other hand I feel that doing things together with other people together as a team that's just the way to do it it's just so much better and I also see you guys that are uh, that are interested in this work and that are involving themselves as part of a bigger team of the team Lebenspraxis. You know, a team that is interested in this stuff, like club in this sense, that is interested in, in being awake, yeah, going through life awake and open and interested in what's happening and what we are doing and what we can do and exploring in different ways. And the question that comes always up is how do I sustain this work like what are what are good ways to offer our services and what are things that people need people are interested in and we have uh, created so many uh, different and at the same time similar things that go all in this direction that are all work for the limbs parks all like uh, pillars of the limbs praxis and we have our free content uh, a lot of free content especially here on the on the youtube channel there is so many hours of uh, material available there and then we have our services you know, of actual coaching then we have our uh, online courses like the Thromp that people can buy. But I felt or I feel like I would like to, I want to have a mode that is a bit l less of this uh, you come and you pay for a product that you then get, which is also fine, no? Like this is also good, like you pay for service and so on. But to have um, yeah, more of this feeling of a club where you become part of our community and we offer things in return and in a more, how would you say, in a, in a less uh, give-take way, in a less direct way. And for this Patreon, I think, is a good option. I looked a bit into the different options, but uh, I will use Patreon for that. And what I want to do is 
to say for everyone that wants to be part of the community that's mandatory to become a Patreon member. So for the people that do the online support and so on, da 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 da. And there I created this tier on Patreon uh, that I call club. Yeah, so club member and for the people that are in this tier, I want to offer uh, again things or continuations of the morning routine, evening routine, yeah, which I stopped for now, uh, not because I didn't want to do it anymore. I really like it. But one reason was, first it was logistically not really possible, now possible again for me to do it. And the other thing was sometimes it's also nice for me to, <laughs> to not directly be in front of the camera in the morning. So it's something I do for I do for a time, then I don't do for a time and so on. Yeah, but things like uh, the streams, things like trainings in Berlin, things like special podcast episodes, special Q and A's, um, just a just a different thing from this free YouTube thing on the one hand and our more premium services on the other hand. Like a thing in between, a, fu a foundational thing. Because my time that I can spend producing free, free things here, free things, not three, but free, free things, three free things. Oh, it's hard for Germans. Uh, free things here on YouTube is limited because my time is very, very limited and I cannot spend all my, not all my time, but you know, it's the, if you look at my channel, the amounts of hours that I have spent creating free things, the amounts of money that I have also spent for this, because many, many of these videos have been created with uh, a professional behind the camera, a professional cutting the material and so on. So for you it's for free, but for me it's not for free to create this. And in a sense also not sustainable, you know, to do it, to do that too much. And I feel it uh, got to a point where I want to have a community that is also more reciprocal where there's more back and forth between us, there's more uh, giving back. And that also means monetary wise. Like if I produce these things here and there are many people uh, benefiting from that, that I think people can also give something or should give also something for that. And, it, and on, at this point, I want to really say thank you for all the people that have done the morning routines or the follow alongs and have said, hey, uh, I'm sending some money over here for this because this is really worth it. And this, uh, yeah. This also shows me very clearly how uh, valuable it is for people because obviously most people uh, don't comment or write or send money and that's also okay it's such an anonymous world nowadays but on the other hand that's not really my vision of how things should be like it it can be there can be an anonymous mess that is using my things and for this in that sense I also produce things like the follow-alongs it's just there and I encourage also people a lot to send it to their friends and other people. And I know physiotherapists are using it and telling people, hey, do this follow along, so do this morning routines and so on. So that's very nice. Um, but to be able to explore more and research more, I will need your support and I will need your help. There's no other way. 
yeah? because there's still a lot to explore for me and a lot to share with you. And I've shared a lot of stuff in the movement uh, world, but actually also the people that are doing more my premium things like the journey or things like the 30 day intensive have seen many other aspects of our work. Yeah, the whole philosophical aspect, the other practices like the crafting or language learning um, or communication and so on and so forth. And in order to share this more with you, these other aspects on various, in various ways, I will use this Patreon page, this club that shall be mandatory for everyone that works with us more closely on the one hand, but also is the option for people that say, I don't have the resources or I don't have the time or I don't want to do any of the, of the premium offers that Josef has, like his coaching, his workshops, yeah, all these things where we get serious about the work and really help you to change and take the next steps because people think nowadays they can find everything on YouTube, but the reality is very, very different from it because the real things are actually not on YouTube, you know, but for the real things, you also need to give something here on YouTube. It goes, it goes to a certain point. Yeah with the follow alongs and so on. And it gives you a very good base if you do all of this. But then there is a deeper level than that, which is uh, also the level of putting things more together. I will put under this video the link to the Patreon page and invite you to become a member of the club. I will share very regularly their things with you and offer uh, ways of communicating with each other because I think that's important. And there I will also continue with streams where I teach, where I present things. Yeah, like I said, podcast episodes that I don't, uh, that I don't publish publicly, uh, some will not continue to publish all the limbs praxis uh, episodes, but some I will keep exclusively for the club members and so on. All right, I think this is a very good way. This is a very good way to build a more close community and to let the work thrive. Yeah, because it's alive if people care about it. And I care about it a lot. I care about it with my whole being. And I know many of you are also caring about it. Yeah, and if you support me, support our work, we are supporting you and we are doing something good together, I think. All right, thank you for watching.